Okay, here's the card I made yesterday, the circuit board. You can see I've already drilled some of the holes. This is for the uh, terminal um, lugs. These will take 14 uh, gauge wire. This will turn out to be the hardest part to get to line up. I wasn't quite right, but it'll fit on like that. And um, the next version, I'm going to move this this terminal board further down to the end. It's a little too close. But it'll be like that, and then I can put the uh, resistors and diode there. So I just need to make <coughs> the holes for said resistors and diode. So I'll just line it up there with my Dremel. Be sure you wear eye protection. That'll do it. I'll put it all together. Okay, I'll start <coughs> with the large terminal block. I'll come up from the bottom so it'll be easier for me to stick it on or solder it onto the board. I'll make sure it's flush. That's good. Make sure I got a clean tip. And I know some of you out there don't like flux, but I do. I got a little bit of liquid flux, just a dab will do you. Solder on the tip and touch it down. And after you get the, the solder on, clean it off with some alcohol to get the flux off. As I've mentioned before, flux is an oxidizer, it'll cause corrosion if you don't get it off. And all we need is some alcohol for that. Another thing I like to do is to uh, check that I got a good connection so it doesn't matter which which end red red or white or red or black. If we get down near to zero I've got a good connection to the board uh, where it's going. I'm good. Now I'll repeat the process with the smaller terminal. This one fits a little better so it's looser. I'm going to have to hold it up with my finger. This could be a little tricky. But I can handle it. And that's good. All right, next uh, I'll assemble the resistors first. Take a really small needle nose, put a 90 degree bend on either side. And fit them into the holes. Okay, I've got everything in. You'll remember if you watched the last video that I put a plus because the diode's uh, pl polarity sensitive. Which way does the diode go? <clears throat> Anode is a positive, cathode is the negative. A plus positive, okay? So a diode uh, always points on a schematic toward the ground. The negative is the, is the little uh, 
stripe. It's kind of I don't have the greatest light. It's kind of hard to see. There's a stripe on one end. That's your cathode. That's the negative. So I have the other side without the stripe up here on my positive or the where the plus was, so that everything will function correctly. Now I just have to cut off these ends a little bit. Then we follow everything just like before. Incidentally, if you have a if you have a soldering iron with two settings or multiple settings, use the lower one. This is equal to about a 40 watt um, electronics type uh, soldering iron. You don't want to damage the uh, dielectric in the re in the re resistors or the diode so use the lower setting. Uh, I have two settings and that's on the lower run right now. And there we have it. Just need to clean it off. Not the greatest looking but it works. If you don't want to make your own, follow along with this. I can make them for you. Uh, contact me offline and I'll tell you uh, price and shipping. Just to finish up, I put in the mounting holes. I got the uh, little plus for, so I know which side is the uh, anode for the LED and which side the track is at and which side the system comes from. Yeah.